morning, Manners. Welcome to another wonderf wonderful day. I'm Kira. And I'm Gavin. And the date is December 14th. I know what I want for lunch today, do you? Yes, I'm bottom. The quote of the day is, is never gives up on your dreams. Hey, Gavin, want to hear something funny? Yes, some bottoms. How do you wash your hands over the holiday? No ideas. With sanitizer. <laughs> sanitizer. You want to hear something cool? <laughs> what? The ice is cool. <laughs> ha! We will now have a moment for quiet reflection. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells rock. Jingle bells sway and jingle bells clang. <laughs> over. We have a high of three and a low of minus two and now we have a guest speaker from mrs rutterham good morning manners welcome to another wonderful day i'm kira and i'm gavin today it's december 13th i mean 14th, 14th. <laughs> that's a blooper <laughs> okay don't do it for tiktok tuesday Gavin. And I'm Kira. And I'm Mrs. Rutterham. Hey, Ms. Rutterham. Who's the leading class in the tickets selling? Leading class so, so far today is um, 8A. So that's Mr. Rutterham's homeroom, followed closely by Mr. Boudreaux's homeroom. They have one ticket seller extraordinaire in both those classes that are bringing in the tickets. Whoever um, sold the most um, tickets, uh, what's the reward going to be? Oh, the reward is going to be kind of a choice. So the, the winning class gets to have a choice of whether they want a pizza party or an ice cream party. Mr. Rutterham, when is the tickets due? Tickets are due for grade 7 and 8 on Monday. So that's December 20th for grade 7 and 8. Grade 6, we need you to get the tickets in on Friday. So unfortunately, you won't have this weekend to sell to get your tickets in. Uh, but you get the tickets in and they need to be in whether they're sold or not. So you're still in the challenge, but um, you just are down by a weekend. So you got to get selling this week, grade 6. What is the makerspace going to be? So the makerspace is this area, and um, our goal is to raise a bunch of money so we can get some really, really cool um, video equipment, some circuit um, things to work with for your science classes, some making makies for tech classes, Lego, various things for innovation and um, innovative learning and exploration. So we'll have craft materials, and essentially a makerspace is where you guys come in, you book it out as a, as a class, and you do project work or STEM activities and all your stuff is um, in this room and accessible. So it's a, it's a great place. We'll even have a makerspace club at lunch where kids can come in and, and create and explore. Uh, we'll have theme questions. So it's a, good, it's a good place, it's gonna be fun. Okay, I have a kind of a two in one question. Yep. Okay, first one is how much money have we raised and uh, what's a rust F a rough estimate on how much you think, how much the school thinks this is going to cost to do? Well, it would depend on um, how much computers we get. So we would like to upgrade our computers in the computer lab because that's part of our makerspace. Um, so right now we have almost $4,000 um, bought in, but some of that money does have to go to the grand in our hand. So we have to remove that. We have to take $1,000 out of that. Um, our goal would be to um, do this type of fundraiser every year so we can replenish and, and constantly be putting things in the makerspace. So our, we would probably, realistically, to have a full house makerspace, we would need probably right around $8,000. Yeah. But we can get it going with what we have right now with our ticket sales. We almost have half of what we need. We almost have half of what we need, but we can't, we do have enough to to get it going with what we have here. Because we do have equipment, yeah. um, but just to keep it keep it stocked and keep it replenished and keep um, our technology, I guess, upgraded. Yeah. Um, I don't think I have any more questions. Thank you. Thanks for coming in, Miss Knopfel. <laughs> Mrs. Rutterham, get selling your tickets. <laughs> Bring them in. This is what they look like. Thank you to everybody who's already sold a bunch. 
We need more, and this is a great community project that you guys are all part of. So we're really proud of what you've accomplished thus far. Like, sell these tickets. So it's time for you guys to hit the books. Mariners! Ahoy! Mariners! Ahoy!